can try, at least. That went well. Although I'm pretty sure she hates me now. Is that, what's the face of the girl next to me? What the fuck happened back there? Are we really going into Marine? Look, I'm sorry it happened this way. As long as you get your army, right? Let's get, yes. get your armor <laughs> patched up in here. Extra bed rolls if you need them. Piss buckets in the corner where it's always fucking been. Long time since we had a piss bucket. I spent two years trying to get where I am now. Don't fuck this up for me, Asher. Oh, right. Does that now, mean shit's gonna hit the fan? Because things are going well, and that's concerning. Achievement unlocked, none so wise. So I have a traitor in my council. I'm thinking it's either the maester. It's not your leg that's a problem, Roderick. Or you've got the to mother. be practical. You got the best of Griff last time. When he comes looking for revenge, do you think you can beat him? He'll be angry. Looking for revenge. It sounds like you prefer if Roderick stayed down in the mud. No. But Griff will see that you pay for what you did. Next time I face Griff, it will be the last. I won't let him parade around my halls any longer. I look forward to it, my lord. But you won't win a fair fight. You can't handle a sword like you used to. So True. find another advantage. Surprise your opponent. Do something unexpected. Like what? I'll show you. Oh? Come at me. Okay. Try not to kill me. Oh. Bring your opponent down to your level. When I attack you, drop down, avoid my blade, and swing at the back of my knees. Wait for okay. me to attack. I thought it was gonna be RT, not A. Let's try it again. Ooh. Ha ha. Ha! Now that's how you do it. <laughs> I think you let me. Oh. <sighs> My lord. Sorry to interrupt. Elena. She insisted on seeing you immediately. Lady Elena, I'm sorry to hear we won't be sisters. Talia. Who's she again? Roderick, can I speak with you? Privately. You remember my little brother? Quiver! Good gods, you've grown. You could just call me Arthur now. I hope you don't mind us coming unannounced. But something's happened. I didn't know what else to do. Maybe this was a bad idea. I'm supposed I to see you. I didn't know if I would see you again. Given how we left things. That... That doesn't change how I feel about you, Roderick. Truth be told, you're the only one I can turn to. Lord Whitehill paid my father a visit at Rillwater Crossing. He told my father you were disobeying Griff's authority and... And he wanted to teach you a lesson. As if I'm some token to be handed around. You mean... He demanded I marry his son, Griff. What? Lud threatened my family. Told my father if he refused, we'd be slaughtered along with you. Father acted the damn coward. He agreed, Roderick. I am oh, to marry Griff Whitehill. Crap. The arrogant pig-eyed prick! I still can't believe father agreed to it. Then you have to defy your father. I intend to. Good. Do you think I want to marry that disgusting pig? But my father won't listen. I'm not going to be the bone they throw that howling dog. I'm not going to be some prize for him to rip open. 
We have to get rid of him. I can't Might think help. of any other way. My father won't see reason. He needs to be taken down. It's time someone brought Griff down. We were hoping you'd say that. Um, are they going to attack me or are they going to attack Griff? From the music, I assume they're attacking Griff. You brought your men. I command Father's elite guard. These men are trained archers, swordsmen, oh, nice. experts in both ranged and close combat. They're yours. If you'll help us take down Griff. Of course. The whole guard? Twenty men. My father still thinks they're aboard a ship bound for the Reach. What do you have to lose, Roderick? Griff has been a nightmare for you and your house. You can't have any reason to keep him around. This could help both of us. Please consider it. I know this might sound mad, but it's the only way. Get rid of Griff, and you'll be free to use the guard however you like. Yes, You can finally I agree. take control of your house again. I agree. Please, promise me you'll do this. Of course. I love you, Roderick. I would you be happy. You have my promise. Thank you, Roderick. Griff won't even see it coming. Let me but guess, it's going to be able to happen. Command. Thank you, Quill. Arthur. Could you give us a moment? You don't know how much this means to me. I'm sorry I couldn't marry you before. Maybe when this is all over, we could play hide and seek in the grove again. <laughs> Pretend we're still children. Forget all that's happened these last few years. I'd like that very much, Elena. Then you know where to find me. <laughs> Kiss her. Woo! It's another coronation already. Our kings just get younger and younger. Tommen's not ready. He's too soft. <laughs> Maybe that was the imp's plan. I wonder if Marjorie Tyrell will be there today. You mean Queen Marjorie? She was married to Joff. <laughs> For all I of one hour. Marry his brother too. Not to I mention put Cersei it past and Jamie. Shh. All the gossips have spies everywhere. What is it, Tom? I remember that warning you'd heard from Roderick. About Whitehill's contact. Did you find anything? Only whispers. But your brother's right. Lud Whitehill. Lud Whitehill is sending a great deal of gold to someone here in King's Landing. Oh? He's definitely up to something. Something big. Well done, Tom. Did you hear anything else? Lord Whitehill is surprisingly secretive. The only people I'm even certain he deals with are those ironwood merchants. They'll both be at the feast after Tommen's coronation today. Maybe you can learn something. I can't go. Marjorie's... She's not exactly happy with me right now. I've been uninvited. Couldn't Sarah help? Ask her to get you in. She'd do it, right? Don't handmaidens look out for each other? We are friends. I'm sure she'd help if I asked her. It's a good plan, then. It's nearly time. Just be careful, Lady Mira. I bet he works with berries. King's Landing seems to have it in for you. cake in the kitchens. Have to guard this one. Locked him up in the old storeroom until morning. That the one who killed Brit? 
He's not going anywhere. Come on. Oh? I'll be back before anyone notices. All right. Maybe just a quick bite. He's likely to freeze to death out here anyway. I'm not gonna go to the North Grove now. Because I have a feeling I might be going to the North Grove. There's nothing for me in the watch anymore. Onions and crab apples. At least I won't starve to death. If I ever find a way out of here. Okay. Let's look at this bucket. Must be the latrine. I'm not sticking around to use it. Let's look at the door. No one out there. Okay. What about... Look at this loose stone. Oh, this one looks loose. Garrett! Oh my god. Potter, what are you doing here? I heard him talking. You're to be executed in the morning. What about Finn? He told Nobody them. Nobody believes him. Or don't oh, want to. Oh shit. They think he's covering for you. Some are even saying he helped you do it. I have to get out of here. That's why I came. I want to help. Well, you'd be executed too. Why would you want to help me? I told you my secret. And you said you were my friend. Well, what kind of friend would I be if I left you to die here? So I'm getting you out of here. I don't want to hear any complaining. You're a good, You're a good man. man. You know that. Don't go singing my praises just yet. <laughs> I want you to take me with you. To the North Grove. I assumed that. You know I can't stay here. I'm leaving Castle Black. But I'd rather not go it alone. So if you're going north, I'm coming with you. Well, I'm not going anywhere unless I can get out of this bloody storeroom first. I can try and pick the lock, but I'm not sure it will work. It's rusted a bit inside. I can get try, out, but it may not do any good. Just keep watch. Make sure no one comes by. I'll see what I can do from in here. Right. Okay. Scraps of wood. Wood's rotten. This is all bloody useless. Pick up the rusty trowel. That might be useful. And I'm gonna use it on this loose stone. What are you doing? Getting out of here. Chip. 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 I can see it. It's coming loose. I'm going to try out. to push it out. You pull, all right? Hey, can you fit through? I think. Fretting Why? Okay, let's escape. Super sneaky. Oh, this is incredibly covert. It's lucky I'm not Frostfinger. Thought you were being sly, eh? I figured you'd try something like this. Finn, 
It's not safe to be seen with us. Then good thing I brought this. Now, let's go. You're not coming with us, Finn. What are you on about? Frostfinger already thinks I'm helping you. What do you think he's gonna do when he hears you've run off with Potato Fucker over here? <laughs> I'd rather take <laughs> my chances fucker. with you. And I'm good in a fight. You know that. Yeah, good at starting them anyway. You'll need another blade at your side. Three's better. Yes. Two. Having another ranger along couldn't hurt. Till he stabs you in the back. We'll talk later. Move. <laughs> 